Black Meister Village, your boy Black Meister, twice the nice that you are used to shop blimps in, and today we are checking out the honest trailer for Fast and the Furious, number uno, or number one, I think I made that, I, I think I got that wrong, but anyway, <laughs> my, my bad for mispronouncing that, but anyway, link in the description down below, please go check it out for yourself first, but let's do it, let's go with Goody! Wait, we haven't done this one already? Are you sure? Weird. Yeah, kind of weird actually. Oh well. <laughs> Before these movies were about secret agents fighting space crime or whatever. <laughs> fighting space crime. Plane. Return to the nuts and bolts of the fast saga. Stealing DVD players. Yeah. Is that a Panasonic PVM939? <laughs> Sick. They're gonna make like a hundred bucks. The first uh, Fast and Furious God. movie. The one with all the thes in it. <laughs> the Fast and Furious. Remember the Point Break? Well, some screenwriter did and figured if they changed all the surfboards into Toyotas, no one would notice. <laughs> <laughs> now, the franchise that would one day become the MCU. Oh, I remember that. Oh, my God. Goes back to its humble roots as an educational series about car parts. I like in the injected pulse. It's your fuel, man. It's got a nasty hole. See a cool air intake and a teeth. Hey, man, I remember when I saw this. I wanted to drive all those cars. Granny shifting, not double clutching like you should. Now me and the mad scientist got to rip apart the block. And replace the piston rings you fry. Nitrous injection. Vin Diesel was pretty good in this movie. Coolers, like he was actually acting in this movie. And titanium valve springs. Look, buddy, I'm not here to read the manual. Can you make my sign look like an angry robot penis or not? <laughs> Witness the birth of the movies that have always been about family, even though half the original cast has been disowned. Way to turn down half a meal for the sequel, Ja. Kuda shoot a luda. But the keepers were all there from the start, like Brian O'Connor, the most obvious cop ever. Look at this snowman right here, man. So it's a good thing he's a stone cold cutie pie. Because when you're done, I'm putting you on the street where you belong, cutie. He's beautiful. I like his haircut. He's on a dangerous undercover mission to infiltrate Dominic Toretto's sister. Yeah. At the center of this early Audi's underworld is human gravel mound Vin Diesel. Let's go for a little ride. A star with such unique charms, he's made a side career out of playing barely alive creatures who can only grunt a single word. But here, he's Dom Toretto, he was, he, the he ex-con who the, runs a cool the Iron Giant? for wayward youth. Dom lives his life a quarter mile at a time. Because if he thought ahead any longer, he might wonder, Wait, why do I rob trucks at full speed with harpoons? Why don't I just make them pull over first? Or should I drive for a living given what happened to my dad? Clipped his bumper and put him into the wall at 120. I watched my dad burn to death. Or like, I've already stolen $6 million worth of DVD players. Why don't I just retire and play with my street sharks? Head shark! <laughs> Return to a pre-gentrification Los Angeles, where the only thing going on at Coachella was truck heists. Mile 114 outside Coachella. That gathers every stereotype in the city, ah. to race through LA's trademark traffic-free streets, and shows off all the candy-colored import cars of a 15-year-old's dreams. Yeah. Because while a Ferrari is well out of your average kid's reach, this film got every mouth breather to put a new exhaust on their Civic and rear end someone because they were playing Snake on their Nokia. I know I did. So after 20 years, nine movies, and a Universal Studios ride that made Vin Diesel the same size as a helicopter, returned to a simpler time when the franchise wasn't trying to outstunt Tom Cruise. The cast could all be in the same room together, and all anyone cared about was finding new and exciting ways to say NOS. Tune the NOS. I need NOS. It's got a NOS fogger system. It's got enough NOS in it to blow himself up. You're lucky that 100 shot of NOS didn't blow the welds on the intake. Me ordered three. T-66 turbos with NOS. NOS! Ah, that explosion is so cute. Now, Starring that's so cute the following now. car puns, as is tradition. <laughs> Baby Driver. Baby Driver. Gran Turismo. Tur Kia. Uh-huh. Hot Rod Wheels. Uh. Carlo Santana. <laughs> Jesse Pink Slip. Oh, my God. Johnny Transmission. Yes. Ja Rule Presents Tire Festival. <laughs> And hello, spoilers. <laughs> Tire special. Car Wars, Rise of Paul Walker. Oh my god. Have they just not ironed out the details of their Corona deal yet, or what? Are the Fast and Furious movies actually good? I can't even tell anymore. We settle whether the franchise is sick bro or suck show in a new video called Love It or Hate It. Click the thumbnail on the right. 
The missions change. They always do. Barnaby, put the potato down. Uh, oh man, that explosion is so cute now. If you look at a Fast and Furious explosion now, this is a whole street. <laughs> they don't even actually need anything to make the explosions. They just step on the ground and there's explosions. You got the rock jumping off of buildings. You got the Vin Diesel stomping bridges like the Hulk and bringing the whole bridge down. Like, geez. Ah, uh, Fast and the Furious. But anyway, <laughs> what do you think, my civil? Let me know in the comment section down below. Talk to your boy. And if you're at this part in the video, I want to say thank you so much for getting to this part in the video. You are spectacular. If you really like this video, I got another one up here. I got a playlist down there, and I got an icon you can click on to subs subscribe. Whoopsies. Hit that bell button and all that good stuff if you do subscribe, and I'll see you all in another video because Meisterman's got to be out. All right? Peace.